Ruth here, and this is the next Wizarding World crate. I say next because it's the next one I've got, so it'll be crate 34, whether it's actually the 34th one. I've got no clue because I think they didn't send them in order or whatever. I have no idea. But I'll just say this is the 34th one. It could be a different one in their order that they did it, but since they backlogged like four... I think I'm so backlogged. Three crates now? There's a two. I'll have to relook, but this is here. I did snip it earlier, but I have to re record because I showed my address. So. <clears throat> Ooh. That's, that's, that's your peak in here. It's got very lovely cursive house names. I mean, look at that. It's very pretty. Very squiggly. Right, so we'll do this first since that's at the very top. So I'll put it down here so you can't see it. And I'll just put it in the other side. So here we have a very gold foiled Hogwarts sorting hat notebook. That looks like it. And if it's the same. Kind of notebook as the Slytherin one I'm using for my diary that I made, then I can make this into the next year's. Oh, well, is that a hole? You can move past it. So let's see if I can open it that way. If not, then I'll find a different point of entry. Let's see. If Uh-huh. That's where I got that tool from. I have no idea. Yeah. Let's see what type of notebook this is. If it wants to be cooperative. Anyway. Oh, come on. Really? Okay, so let's put this in the trash. Okay. So this is... Looks like parchment on the inside. Oh, that's lovely. They've got the sticker printed on the inside. That's... And it looks like parchment. Aged parchment. Kind of. Or is that just normally how parchment looks? It's got it on the back cover as well. Very lovely to read. Okay, one more page than the previous uh, Southern notebook that I'm using as a diary um, that I made into one because I couldn't find a 2023 one that I liked. Um, curious about what that looks like. I've got it on my Instagram. But um, it is 65 pages. It'd be oh, very useful if I actually told you how many pages this thing had. But I call it 2022, so it's one of the older ones that I'm waiting for. Technically, I didn't actually buy a January one, so I don't have any 2023 ones to come. That's pretty gold. Shiny. Shiny. Everybody loves a little shine. Um, yeah, so that'd be good for my next 2024 week view planner diary thing. I mainly use it to, you know, write out 
how much I spend. Because, like, I need to. <laughs> the amount of I spend, it's, uh, I do need to keep track of that. <laughs> anyway, that's great. I've got the next one. It's got one page more than last time, so. Yes. So that's this. It's very nice. I like the parchment look to it. It's very lovely. Well, you can really see that on the camera. It's very nice kind of aged to it. So that's great. So that's this one. Next up we have a t-shirt, which by the look of it, it is the exact same artwork as this. And I guess this would be a... Well, it does say... Well, it does say on the, on the print. But it does have the Draco Dormans Nunpom Tiflandus. Is that how you pronounce the Latin? I'm not, I'm not, I don't know. But this obviously is, that was the school um, saying, logo, slogan. What is that word? It's not slogan. It's not anything. It's school motto. I'll go with that. Obviously, this is a uh, large. Anyway, yes, this is nice. I don't know if I'd wear it out really. It's a very big print. I would have preferred like a smaller one, like on the on the, on the patch. But it is empty on the back by the looks of it. Very nicely folded this way. I folded it very nicely. But um, yes, so that is that. Next up, since it's staring me right in the face, is a Hogwarts hat pin. I could have sworn we have it we had we got a smaller one. In one of the earlier boxes. I would have thought. I think we did. I'm not too sure. But uh, next up we have. Ooh! Hogwarts House Relics Magnet Set. That's nice. I'll just put it on my filing cabinet. <laughs> I don't have anything else that's magnetic, really. If you want to have a look, see? There my filing cabinet side. See that one came in a previous crate and so did that one as well. That one as well, I believe. And those three up top. <laughs> because obviously they're sticking there by themselves. <clears throat> yeah, the uh, Luna based, Riddle based, Southern based, Hermione, and Dunstra. Um, there's room. I'm pretty sure it came in a little crate. Or it came in one of that other knockoff uh, loot box. Whatever thing. Anyway, yeah, I'll stick these on my uh, filing cabinet. That's nice. Um, just... Next up. Oh. This is a very big. Ooh. And it's house themed. Not the logo, not the uh, the castle. That's nice. It says Slytherin on it, and it's green. And it's got a sneaky right there. Let's do the. I mean, pets are always useful. You take them shopping. Do all sorts of things. You can store things around. Carry things. Oh, you can even take it if you want to pick it. I'll just briefly lay it out so you can have a look soon. There. It's got the word Slytherin. 
right there. There is the link on the back by the looks of it. See, all it just says is a magical destiny oversized tote. Magical destiny? Okay, that's, that's one way to put it. But this is a very decent sized tote bag, I believe. And in the string. But yeah, you can obviously put lots of good stuff in here. So that's good. Whoops. Um, here we try to Anyway, yes. So this is that. I'm just flip that in half so I can stick it. Oops, I'm dropping things left and right. There. I said do a setup now. As I go, and then we'll faff around the afterwards. There's this that one. There's the, uh, the pin. It's slightly disappointing, really, because I believe they did give us a smaller sorting hat. Or it's the exact same one. I don't know. But that is disappointing. I was hoping it would be something else or maybe a new series. Okay, we got one last item. There's no cheat sheet in there, so it doesn't tell me what the stupid thing is. I have to look and maybe make an educated guess. But okay, so what is this thing? Ooh, Hogwarts House Tumblr. It says it right here. That's nice. Ooh. It's slightly transparent as well. See? You can see through. Um, where did I put this? Just put that in the box. Uh, I'll need it for pictures. Hey, this is nice. It's got a nice... Here it is. Okay, that sounds plastic. That sounds metal. There it is. It does sound classic though. Also, see, made in China, hand wash only, Freedom microwave, 2022. Okay. Smell some, I guess. <laughs> Not sure what I'm supposed to be smelling. Obviously, take the top off. Let's see. I personally prefer bottles with a straw or with a spout. This is what you drink. But anyway, it doesn't say how many milliliters it holds, which it doesn't. Sometimes they put it on the bottom, but there's nothing on the bottom. It's just blank. Um, yeah, that's that's what it. Um, don't know if you want to read it. Let's see. That's the, uh, you know, basic version of the thing. And here is the logo. The Hogwarts crest. Well, not really. Well, sort of the crest. And... Not the animal representations. And the same... Artwork right here is here. Interesting. Okay. That's nice. Let me just place that right there. Um, I'm just gonna quickly go to my desk and check something. Just pause. Okay, I looked at my list because I made a note of the theme name when they released it. This one looks like Hogwarts School Spirit. So this one would technically technically be crate number 35. So, <laughs> cause like obviously this is not outside Hogwarts. <laughs> I mean, unless you wanna count the tumblers as an outside Hogwarts thing. But this is Hogwarts, it seems like Hogwarts School Spirit, I think. I mean, I could be wrong, but, um, 
I'll label this as crate number 35 and leave the 34 in blank until the next crate and see if I need to swap them around. <laughs> um, yeah, that's basically it. So, um, let's see, I have, um, this is a good box. I'll keep the other posted or something, but I think for once I'm not going to sell anything on my eBay on any of this. I think. But I quite like them all. Uh, but, um, Using a stick on her. Okay. So I'll just place this in the recycling box. I think I might have to collapse it because I don't think anything will fit in the recycling box. Oh, well, that just bounced out. Oh. Um, anyway, I'll put that in there. Um, yes, that's, that's everything, I believe. So, um, what? Let me do this. Place it here. And you'll be able to see it. Sort of. I'll have to put it off a bit. Then you can sort of see it. Anyway, I say that word a lot. So, what's your favorite? If anyone's got a favorite, if anyone wants to comment. Oh, um, that's very useful. I will definitely use that because I've been needing it one, and I think I have another one that I didn't use yet, but I wasn't sure. Plus, it was a lot smaller than this, so I like, wasn't sure about using that either. I mean, I think I was maybe going to use that as the next washi tape scrap book when I finished with this one, maybe, but that was really small and like. like how I did it. I separated. Well, I got quite a few pages left in this one. These ones are blank. I got do I do have blank spaces on some others, but like obviously this is the anime and miscellaneous. And this is all Harry Potter related. I think the only official Harry Potter washi tapes I have are these three. The Paris and this one. Anyway. I wonder how many times I said anyway. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe for more. Ring the bell for notifications. Over and out.